Hey guys, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. I'm Sheridan. Nice to have you here today. But in today's video, I decided to do a video on how I cleaned my sensor on my Canon M200. There's not a lot of videos on mirrorless cameras and how to clean them. I didn't see a whole lot on YouTube, but I saw a little bit. But this is going to show you exactly what I use, what kit I bought, and the process of me cleaning it. So, hope you enjoy this video. So, let's get on into the video. So, look at these white spots that are on my camera. We're going to try to clean the sensor. So, in this footage, you can see two white dots on the sensor. Take the battery out. So, I took the battery out so my camera wouldn't turn on accidentally, and then I took the lens off. And then you just want to blow out any dust that could be in your camera with the blower. And you want to do that with your camera facing down so any dust can fall down. <laughs> still there so if you have really stuck dust spots on your sensor you're gonna have to clean it with the sensor swabs and all you do is spray a bit of the solution on the sensor swab and swipe once one way and turn it and then swipe the other way I see one more little smudge that I need to get we're on our sun test and I don't see any dots do you and I looked on the test footage and it's almost completely clean. I think we're clean now. Trying to see if I see anything. Here's Chloe. Our sensor's clean. So I ended up using two cleaning swabs because you're not supposed to reuse these. You're supposed to just wipe it once and then turn it over and wipe it the other time on your sensor and then get a new one. So I had to do it four times across this way and then flip it over across that way. And then I still saw a spot in that test footage, the sky footage. So I went and then did that again you know so I used two which is okay because I know cleaning a sensor costs more if you get somebody else to do it and I still have four sensor cleansers left and I used two so it comes with six which is pretty good and I'll show you the rest of the kit somebody's texting me but I'll show you the rest of the sensor cleaning kit so I'm filming on my camera now and this is a while later but I just forgot that I did not show you the kit so it comes with this brush it looks like a blush brush and you just dust off the camera the outsides of your camera you saw this in the video this is the blower to blow off any dust inside the camera or I guess you can use it on the outside as well so that's those two things then we have a little microfiber towel and then we have an empty little spray bottle a bigger microfiber towel or cloth whatever you want to call it and then we have this pen it has this brush that you can dust off the outsides of your camera and then it has this little buffer that you can buff like the lens that has that and that just closes and there's a lid that goes on that side and then we have the solution that you spray on like the microfiber cloths before you clean the lens and you also spray it on the little swabs before you clean the sensor but not very much and you've already seen these but I have four of these left it came with six I used two in the cleaning portion and this is lens tissue paper so I guess you spray the solution on this and use it as like a disposable cleaner for your camera so 
I haven't used those yet, but I've used pretty much everything else already in the kit. But this is the kit. It is quite expensive, but it's worth it, especially if you have a mirrorless camera that the sensor gets dirty really easily. And also, I took some footage of my cameras, how clean they looked after I dusted them off. I also did the spray nozzle inside of my Sony camera to spray out all of the dust in that lens because it doesn't have a detachable lens so I didn't clean the sensor or anything and I also just cleaned the lens with all these like microfiber cloths and stuff and I cleaned their outside so they didn't have as much dust and stuff and this is the footage of what they look like after I cleaned them. But that is all for this video. I would recommend this kit. It's good for the price and it was a lifesaver because now I can use my camera again. So, see you guys in the next video. I love you guys. Bye guys!